Alright, hello there. I'm Milo Hogan Apperly, and this is my ePortfolio Tour and Reflection video. Yay! Uh, so, I'm almost done. So, um, in terms of last changes, I'm just gonna go through this. Um, I didn't actually make any. Uh, I think a lot of my assignments I got high 90s or 100s, so really I don't think making any changes is necessary because of that uh, so we're gonna skip that because I didn't I didn't do anything I just added the new stuff um, the secondary school graduation stuff and that was it for this unit plus the quizzes and whatever uh, but anyways uh, so for the video tour um, what I put on my home page to represent me and why uh, so as you can see here, this is my home page. You click the index button at the top, you get here. Um, really, it's not... I mean, the only way it, it kind of reflects me is that it has my, my amazing looking face right there. Um, I like red, and I like like simple, minimalist stuff. So, I kind of went with that. I didn't add any like extra pictures of me or anything. I uh, didn't think that was necessary. I just like how plain and normal it looks. There's no clutter or anything. So I think it reflects me pretty well, despite there not being much. So there's that. Uh, brief explanation of the layout. I guess I kind of did that. Um, also the navigation. I, I wanted everything to go through this navigation tab instead of having them like a bunch of different ones up here. I think it's just easier if you always go through the, the net, well, except for clicking the main button, but you wouldn't really ever go to the main page anyways, except for when you first start it up. Um, so through the navigation, you know, you can go to the about, which has a little bit about me, and you can go to the health and relationships and all that. Um, so that was my plan for that. Um, also with photos, I wanted it so I wanted to upload them to a different site so you could zoom in a lot more um, because I don't trust Tumblr and and its whole layout thing. It's kind of inconsistent and annoying. So I just uploaded it somewhere else and then linked to it. Um, and then as for yeah, I mean, actually, I'm going to zoom in here. That's one problem with this layout. It's The font is very small, so you kind of have to zoom in to see everything. Um, so that's the layout. There's also, oops, there's also like a contact button here. I'll just close that, actually. Um, so you could ask me questions, um, but I don't think anyone's going to do that. <laughs> um... Which projects do I consider to be my best? So, out of all of these uh, like little assignment projects, uh, I think that the one I spent most time on um, would have been, first of all, the, hap the Pursuit of Happiness one. Uh, I wrote a couple of drafts of that, actually. It's still kind of messy, but that movie was cool. So, I had spent a lot of time thinking about that one, and. Um, I'm working through that. I don't know if that counts as a project though, so I'll, I'll do another one here. Um, the fad diets, I also did quite a bit of work on. I just did like a quick little result thing, but I had like, I don't want to open it, but I think it's somewhere in here. Anyways, I had like a bunch of information about it all written down, so I had a lot of, um, uh, research went into that one and also let's see no no this actually the job interview I think yeah job interview I'm gonna talk about this because I thought it was one of my best ones but also um, it fits into the um, challenging part because I originally planned to like shoot a video and I had certain parts of it all set up but it it was near the deadline and I had plans fall apart basically um, I wasn't able to to film it as I wanted to so kind of last minute I I went on to the GoAnimate site and and 
did this little short film thing. Um, so I was happy with how it turned out, uh, <laughs> despite it being very last moment. Uh, so that's probably one of the better ones. Um, let's see. Enjoyable. I just, I mean, I just like setting this all up. I, I spent a lot of time uh, just going through and changing all of the customization stuff here, all the different colors. Um, I did all of these in the HTML, so it got kind of messy. That took some time to figure out and learn, but I don't know. I think it paid off. It looks, it looks okay. Uh, anyway, yeah, so I found that part enjoyable. <laughs> uh, just, I don't know, it was kind of weird um, for planning 10 because I'd already finished grade 10 um, two years ago. So it's kind of kind of weird going back and, and for certain things like the type focus, doing it again. Um, and actually also with this thing, which I just did. Uh, oh, is this where this video is going to go. Anyways, with this thing that I've already done that, so doing that again was was strange. Um, but I mean, overall, planning 10 was, was cool. <laughs> I mean, it didn't take a lot of effort because I'm also doing planning 12, so there was a lot of crossover between the two. Um, and that's pretty much it. I mean, I learned like basic stuff like a lot of work well yeah like a lot of um, um, type focus stuff and the journal thing again made me think about life it was very deep and introspective I guess um, but it, yeah I mean unfortunately I didn't learn too much because I'm already I've already done something like this and I'm doing the grade 12 one so I mean, it was still good. I'm not saying it was bad or anything, but I've already, I've already done it, sort of. Uh, and then, I guess, last thing to talk about would be the significant changes. I originally actually made my portfolio on um, WordPress, um, but I, I think it was during unit unit two. I was trying to format something. It just wasn't working for me, and I got really angry. I think it deleted my account, and then I made this one. So, um, it's a pretty big change. It went from something that was pretty bad, and now it's this, and I like this a lot better. So, that was a big change. But yeah, again, I didn't change any actual information in it. So, yeah. I mean, that's, that's pretty much it. So, um, so thank you for, for doing this, uh, and marking all my stuff, and giving me good marks. I appreciate that, and uh, yeah, I can't wait to graduate, so thank you, and goodbye. <laughs>